Tennessee visits Alabama as a 15 and a half point underdog this Saturday afternoon. Right now we're joined with college football analyst Troy West from allplayswin.com to break down his free picks on this game. And Troy, look, Alabama hasn't covered at home since week one when they hosted Wisconsin. Tennessee's coming off a bye week. They've had plenty of time to heal up, sort of get ready for what's probably going to be the most aggressive game of their season. Plus, Alabama is going to see what is probably their biggest challenge so far this season. Next week, when they face Fournette and LSU, uh, can you really trust Alabama to be motivated enough to cover 16 points here, Troy? Well, yeah, you hit it right on the nose. You know, Alabama's been so bipolar in terms of covering spreads throughout the course of the year. They, they go on the road, and they look fantastic, and they've had several letdowns at home. They had a letdown against Old Miss. They had a letdown against Arkansas. This game, to me, smells like another letdown, and I do think Butch Jones and the Tennessee Volunteers will bring their A game. This is a team that plays good defense. They like to run the football. I think they'll do enough to keep it close. I, will my personal money be on it? Probably not. I never bet against Nick Saban in Alabama. But for the sake of SBR videos and for the sake of a pick, I do think the Tennessee Volunteers will keep it within that number. They're well coached. They're good on all facets of the football. And like you said, Alabama could potentially be looking ahead to next week. Tall, tall task to beat anybody in the SEC by 16 plus points, let alone a pretty darn good Tennessee team. So I'll take the points here. All right. Now the total is at 56 in this game. Would you put an official play on that line, Troy? I would most, most likely lean on the under. I think both these teams do like to run the football. You don't see a lot of hurry up offense and you do see pretty good defense. So I would put a lean on the under, but it wouldn't surprise me if, if Alabama caught fire and was able to put up 30 to 40 points like they have in past football games. So pass for me on that, but I would probably lean on the under. College football analyst Troy West from allplayswin.com. Thanks again for joining us and for the insight. Thanks guys.